Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another striker break. And we've got some technical difficulties. Hold on one sec. Let's see if I can figure this out. Check, one, two, okay, wow. You know, when it rains, it pours. I wanted to do this last night, but it just didn't happen. It's like every time you get an update on your computer, everything kind of gets wonky and resets, and then there's a driver update, and that that's boring. We don't need to talk about it. How's everybody doing? We're finishing off the case. 2024 series one hangers i opened eight of them in the video just to get a little taste we're gonna do the rest of the case today right here right now two streams today morning stream evening stream we're gonna do some friday night fire also the tier finally inside this package is the the moment we've all been waiting for Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Lots of people in here. Kyle in here nice and early. We got Casey and Wong, Jenks. What's going on, everybody? I'm, I'm a little, I'm a, I am mean, why am I so worried about this? I'm worried and nervous. It's a thick card. It's my first thick card I've ever sent away to get graded. It looked perfect to me, but um, if I had to guess, I would say just randomly, like, I don't know, probably like a seven. I'm going to set my expectations real, real low. Oh, yeah, that's huge. That's huge. Yes. Woo. Oh, I mean, the thing is perfect, but with a thick card, you know, there's got to be something here and there, but that is a my, my monster gray down a thick boy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, it looks good in a case. Looks good in a slabberino. Oh, 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 my best card. It's got to be my best card. One of my best, if not the best. Whoa. Every time I look at it. Number to five, one of five. We got a chill relaxation stream today, ladies and gentlemen. This is a personal break, so we can just take our time, talk about whatever, open some friend mail. Austin, this one's from Austin. Thank you in advance, Austin. Happy Friday once again. Clinton, how are you? Mark, Solomon family, AZ, Scott, Vino, what's happening? BT, 
What time am I dropping breaks tonight? That, that is a secret. That's why you got to become a slammer. If you're a slammer, you will know. But we're only doing two. Only two breaks. It's I, I'm burning the candle at both ends, and this is getting ridiculous. I'm going to get burnt out if I don't just pull back just a tiny little bit. So we're only doing two breaks tonight. I know. Only like who knows how many hours of streaming, but... One buy in max. Oh, wow. Somebody remembered a powerful honor. I've got a pretty decent little PC of a powerful honor. A little rainbow action happening. That's cool. And Bobby. Cup card, ice parallel. These are out of the super boxes, I believe. J9, thanks for the $5 dono. Good luck with the rip. Hope you pull some fire. Thank you. Oh, back to. Oh, no. <gasps> no, 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 not anymore. No, no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> not a green one, too. Oh, it's a different one, and it's green. <laughs> the green K's are the grossest ones. Uh, for the love of all that. <clears throat> well, these cards are cool. Thanks. I'll have to add these to the collection. Black coffee, the only way. We used to we used to do little morning streams every once in a while. You guys remember those Monday morning mixers? Just like the internet acts up a lot, and there's always an issue when I try to do a morning stream. But not today. Well, actually, there have been like five today already, but. Vino Chris with a 19.99. Congrats on 50K. Well done. Thank you. Mr. Enfuego, got your uh, got your message. And yes, I'll email you about it, though. We'll talk. Buenos dias. It's just super busy right now, Mr. Enfuego. But yes, we will do that. Hey, okay. Kevin. This one's from Kevin. Greenskeeper was telling me about this one. Um, I don't want to get his address on here. So I'm just going to kind of... I'll go off to the side. So you got to be real careful with this big old blade. So it doesn't slice right through my desk. through the whole thing. Got about a half inch piece of solid wood and it'll cut right through it. If you want to send me anything, PO Box 292, Lapeer, Michigan, 48446. better not be a box full of K's. It's a box full of K's. You're going to see a fire started live. Mm. 
Nothing, nothing but problems around here sometimes. Okay, come on, you can do this. There we go, there we go. Better not be a box full of Ks. Hey, Striker, I hope these get to you before Series 1 releases. I've sent 10 card stands. Was hoping you would give them some kind of review. One of those guys who hates to buy something when I know I can make it. Mm -hmm. So that's what I've done here. They are powder-coated aluminum. I'm a sheet metal worker by trade. So they won't scratch bare cards or top loaders. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Profit's going to go directly towards Rip and Wax. Greenskeeper shout out. Oops. Hopefully that contact info. All right, let's check them out. Are they individually wrapped? Oh, these are the real deal. Look at these. Yes, very nice, very nice, legit. And we got multiples. Good job. Lightweight. Yeah, I like them. Got a whole box of them here. I'm currently working with another card stand company on the on the verge of getting something going, so all the timing was a little, a little off for me. I am going to throw these up on a couple of them up on the stage here. Let's let's get some use out of them. We got a box of them. K. Here, let me put his email up here. If anybody's interested, wants to get some. <clears throat> Ksmitty117 at yahoo.com. All proceeds will go to Rip and Wax. My kind of guy. Mr. Infuego. What better way to enjoy a Friday at work than this with a 16 month? Thank you. 50 buck Chuck likes the blade. The blade likes you. But you don't want that blade to like you too much. Damascus. You guys ready? It's time to begin the show. I left it all on the stage so we could see. What did we get so far out of eight? We're going to have a mountain. Enormous mountain of boxes behind us. Let's play this the right way. We'll, we'll establish a firm foundation of trash so that we can have a, a legitimate mountain. 64 boxes, and we're already at the top of the trash can. Yo, Jay. You know if Tops is still doing triple threads as Sir Da Bomb, one, two, three? I do not know. But we don't have it yet. And it would appear that if they were going to have it, it would be out already. Here's how we do this. Whew, right through there. We don't need to look at any of that. None of it. This is what we want. Tyler Soderstrom, stars of MLB Chrome. That's what we want. 
We'll put them right there. Another yellow Astori Ruiz. No, thank you, though. We got enough of them already. Okay, so this is going to be a bust pack. That's what a bust pack looks like. Where you don't get any parallels other than their, other than your yellers. Open on getting, at the, you know, you get a chrome and a yeller. If you're wondering what a bust pack looks like, if you didn't already pull one for yourself. There it was. Let's just pretend it never happened. Go right into the next one. Mellow with an 18 month striker. Just pull some fire, will ya? Yes, I will. If there's anything that I can do in this world, it's pulling fire. I'm not too good at anything else, but pulling fire. And also you don't want to meet me at the poker table. Be a bad day for your personal finances. Trim with a 24 month. Good morning and good luck. Go Brewers. Good to see you in here, Trim. Celebration of the kid. Ooh, Chrome Ellie. I'm going to hold on to that one. I'm going to hold on to that one. Are we going to put him on the stage? I think so. I'm in a good mood. I've never been more happy with a nine in all of my days. I've never been happy with a nine. End of sentence. Until today. I guess the sentence wasn't over. Freddy Peralta. Couple of yellers. A lot of nothing. We're running into some bust packs. Back to back bust packs to start the show? Out of here. Ridiculous. I'm going to try to keep things organized a little bit. Because I'm going to, well, my guy Gary's in, called dibs on these all these cards. So we'll see. We'll see. Cold these cards. Have you opened any blasters yet? No. No blasters yet? But I got a whole case of them ready to go. I might do that this weekend. It depends on how many likes we can get. And how many people we can get in here, here in the chat. I'd love to see a thousand in here. I'm going to shoot for the moon. Thousand concurrent. That means everybody in here has just got to stick around and it'll happen. If everybody in here sticks around. For a short amount of time, it'll happen. Blue Vlad. Okay, we got a parallel other than the yeller, and we got a flipperoo. Another rainbow. So, rainbow, blue, two yellers, and that's it. Hangers. I mean, they've, they've got what it takes to be the best. We just have yet to see it. Golds aren't flowing like they were yesterday yet. Three golds from yesterday. Not one to speak of, though. Two additions to Series 1. The Kevin Hart parallel on the Phillies card. And the first card logo on Rookies 2. Oh, yeah. the fr I haven't even been looking at it. I don't think I've seen a first. What's up with that? How rare is that? Lucky for you, I have the odds pulled up right here. Don't know how to find that though. Control F first? Nope. That noise you hear means nope. No, I haven't gotten a Philly, uh, Kevin Hart card, but it, I would imagine it would be in the center of the pack, right? Home run, Adley. This year, I'm going to do my home run challenge cards. Although, I said that last year, too, and I didn't do them. I didn't do any of them last year, and I had probably like 50 of them. 
What are we doing? Are we on repeat? Or is this just... No, they just all just sound the same. Okay. It's a little better. Number to 52 because he's 5 foot 2. Is he that tall? They are not on the checklist. Yeah, there were like three little surprises. The Otani Soto SPs. It's a little, a little thin. Otani and Soto SPs. They didn't really make a big deal about the firsts, which I don't know why they need to do that, but they already have firsts. Why do we need two firsts? That's counterintuitive this is their second first first but kind of their first tops card because of the other first was a bowman but it's both tops but okay loaded pack gold and rainbow foil no yellow foil and rainbow foil yellow foil number two and yeah they look they look almost identical to the gold foils almost i can tell they're yellow but i think a lot i think a lot of people would be confused by it kyle bradish gold we're gonna need like a jd le one of the big boys in a gold. We're going to need that, like numbered gold. And it's going to need to be crisp. Maybe an auto, too. Do we got an over-under? These are 64 box cases, King Leo. 64. You know what's going to happen. It's just, are you going to be here live for it? When I slice my finger open, fillet it like a fish. I don't want that though. Big L, 12 month. After I'm done making Cheetos, I've got 10 to rip. Good luck, Big L. Big Bear looking for a shout out to his son, Will. Shout out. Getting over that stomach bug. I hope you feel better. That's no fun. Good vibes heading your way. Look at we got vintage stock. Vintage stock. Be a big one. No! Astros team card. That's one of the last ones I would want. But Nando home run challenge. He's gonna hit some of those. Wait till he goes to Colorado. Use that one. Oh, the vintage stocks are so good this year. Houston Astros team card. I know I'm going to get, I'll take it. I'll take it. Here, send it my way. I don't think I will. But you know what I will do with it? I'll put it in a top loader, put it in a box, and it'll never be seen again. Corbin Carroll cup card. You guys hear the Gunnar Henderson news? There's a little bit of news on the Gunnar front. It's not good news. He's dealing with an oblique. And I quote, Gunnar Henderson parentheses oblique told reporters Friday that he isn't in jeopardy of missing the start of the regular season. That's good. And he added, he isn't concerned after experiencing left oblique soreness during a long toss session, three weeks, comma, poor writing. Did the editor get a hold of this CBS or no NBC? I don't think the editor got a hold of your statement here. 
So that's it's not horrible. It's not horrible news. He's, he'll be okay, but obliques tend to linger. Hopefully it's just a real light. Nothing really. Just a little bit of soreness from not, not throwing a whole lot. Yeah, they are awful, and they can linger indeed. She makes room for holiday. I, well, it says he's not in jeopardy of missing the start of the regular season. I don't think we need to make room for Jackson. I think he's got all the room he needs. They want him opening day to be the guy. Judge Chrome, Blue Castillo, Rainbow Foil, Mateo. Anytime now. Like, the parallels are piling up. Anytime now. Look at these things. We're like not even a quarter of the way done. Stars. Started out separating stars of MLB. That ended real quick. Enjoy the vibes. Let it soak into your body. Chris. You thought this was just a regular vid, but we're live. Good morning, Johns and Dad Sports Cards. No, yeah, I don't think he tear, tore anything, Will. It just sounds like a little bit of a sore muscle, hopefully. But that's not a great way to start the season. Miss anything tasty? Uh, yeah, Eric. A little. Got a nine, which is awesome. On a thick boy. Oh, I was, I was just, you know, you never know. Cards like that can look perfect and then they come back and they're a six. Which would like totally kill the vibe. Look at this. We got a couple of bouncy cards. Bounce them around like that. Hmm. We got three blues so far, no perps. That's the nine ninety nine. I'm gonna double stack him with Brennan Rogers, cause you know why. There's so many of these to go. So many. I hope you enjoy the show. The best card out of 2024 so far? None. I don't think I've gotten any. I haven't ripped that much. One hobby, one jumbo, and then here we are. Wiki asks, did you end up sending that Harris first base card to the upgrade shop? I don't remember what you're talking about. I've got like 10 cards in card savers right now, ready to ready to go, but I there's no time. Like you gotta in order to get a PSA order, at least how I do it, it's like I'm setting up a surgery. In between every card, I'm cleaning the surface, and I'm like, I got magnifying glasses out, and I got a little, little soft sleeves for, for wiping, and it's a, it's a huge ordeal, and I gotta like <clears throat> move around my whole setup and get everything, so it's just a pain. So sometimes I'm just like, I'm just gonna list all this stuff raw. I don't even. Unless it's a monster. Bust pack? Got a few bust packs happening. There's the greenskeeper. TGIF. You're hiding under your desk? All right, that's cool. 
There's a few people that are doing that. 785 in here. Totally. We can get to 1,000. It's just up to guys like the Greenskeeper hiding under their desk. Setting up a whole scene like Home Alone in the office. Get some dummies on strings to make it look like everybody's working. JT says, I opened up a case of hobby, pulled a game used to 25 Julio four color patch. Wow. Congratulations. What's up, Memphis Wax? Yeah, I opened up your buddy's thing, uh, card stands. They're great. Matt McLean cup card. I like that. Dude, I must leave it up. That's how much I like it. Get us a big yellow for the love of mercy. That many yellows so far. Only two stand worthies. Start hyping it up. I know we're going to get Ellie. A primary color scheme of Ellie with a yelly. Ellie with a yelly. Got a nice ring to it. So you know what they did, I feel? <laughs> Since there's only 59 cards and there used to be like 67, they kept the boxes the same size. It's like a little bit of extra room in there to wiggle around. I think. Maybe not, but. King, what up? Probably create a whole base set with those yellows. No, we'll have a third of a base set by the time it's said and done. Wait, no. So yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll have about a third of a base set. Relic. That looks like a Riley Green relic. It's a good pack. Game used Riley, we'll take that. Put him in a little 75, and get him up on the stage with his boys. Bobby home run challenge and a good yellow, maybe. Yellow Yelich, no, no, okay. Let me keep my head up. I guess I don't need the knife. If I can just open it that easily. It's more of a novelty thing. Eliana Yelly, that's right, David. Brian's four hangers in. Open for some Ellie or Evan color. You'll get it. I believe in you. Couple had three, you had a couple hangers with three numbered ones. Okay, that's why you do a case. Floyd fan with a $5 dollars do not Morning striker. Tried out some retail yesterday. Nothing big, but got a nice PC card. Christian Yelich Easter base card. Hopefully get a winner soon. I know you will. Good luck. I'm looking forward to my blasters. That'll be fun. Our first purple is Ryan Jeffers. I still think that purple should have been the $9.99 and the Blues should have been to seven ninety nine. Not a deal breaker, but it's something. We're gonna have two competing stands: perps and blues. There. Welcome to Strikers Friday Morning Fire, where. Danny Jansen and the Dodgers yellows are plentiful. If you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. You won't regret it. 
I don't know how it would be possible to regret it. No, we get the knife in play. Thanks, Prince. 505. That tip. Any no noise, 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 Royce in my PC? I listed all my Royce Lewis cards in my eBay store. Just sold the Sapphire the other day. I don't PC Royce. Gold. Come on, big gold. Rookie. It's a rookie gold, but I saw a P, so. Quinn Priester. At least it's a rookie. Hunter Brown. Come on, come on, come on. Sometimes you got to yell at them. They don't take too kindly to it. It usually doesn't work. Three enormous stacks to go after this. When I say three, I mean six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 42 more to go. Eric says, I predict you hit 100,000 right before Christmas. Wow, that would be amazing. I was doing the math on it. I mean, we would, I would, uh, I know what it takes. And it would have to be like nonstop crush fest from here till Christmas. It's possible. This is a full case, Matthew. Hat tip, Matthew, my guy. Full sealed case of hangers. <laughs> Mmm, it smells like success. I haven't tasted these ones yet, by the way. Should I give them a little taste? Kids, don't do this at home. I'm sure it's poison. It doesn't sting like the previous. Some previous ones have stung the tongue a little bit. Reed Detmers. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Other than a pile of yellas. Ian with a dollar ninety nine. Thank you, my friend. Shorts, yeah, well, here's the thing about shorts. Because I can see the numbers on every, all of it. Like, YouTube's really good about giving you information about how how your videos do, all of, like, when people watch, when they stop watching, what they don't like, what they do like, demographic info, all that kind of stuff. With the shorts... They don't do much, at least for me. Like you got to get like a million views on a short to even. I bet you if you got like a million views, you would make like a hundred bucks or maybe less. I don't know. And it's not all about making money or anything like that, but it's like you got to have a reason to spend the time to do stuff. And it's like other things do better. Even as far as subscribers some people get a lot of subscribers from shorts i haven't gotten that many but i just you know i like making them sometimes sometimes it's a hassle and i don't like it other times it's other times i'm like sitting on the couch i can make a short for my couch if i wanted but then you got to upload it and then you got to get to the p you don't have to get to the pc from there soderstrom rookie blue I would say that's the best blue so far to $9.99. Volpe Future Stars Yellow. A little bit of collectability. Guardians, Gavin Williams rookie. Okay, okay.
I know a lot of you are wondering, how's the aftertaste on that card? It's not great. Got a better aftertaste. In fact, I think I'm going to wash it down. <clears throat> what if they had to start putting, do not put these in your mouth because of what I just did. Just check in the back to see if it's already on there or if it's going to happen now. Haven't any luck. Not yet. Not yet, Andrew. Tough news about Gunner and Bradish. Well, yeah, we just read the Gunner news, and I think he's going to be okay. It says he's going to be just fine, so I'm not worried. He's not even in jeopardy of missing the start of the regular season. It's a weird one. Yeah, it's kind of a weird one. Sal Freelick yellow. I like that. Kind of a color match. One of the better hits. I'm going to put him in front of Julio just so we have a nice little array of yellows in the back. <clears throat> Member chat, King? My bad. King Emmanuel says, asks, are hangers indeed bangers? They're banging. I can tell you this. Hangers are better than, like this year's hangers are better than they were last year. Because of the yellows, especially. The yellow, yellow foil, and then the numbered yellowed, yellow ones make hangers better and the fact that they have the holiday parallels and blasters blasters are better and jumbos feel like just as good as they were last year coco goldo i'm starting to get lazy with these piles already I'm going to have to go through afterwards. Floyd fan with a $5 donation. 2023 Goodwin Champions has a don't eat warning on the box. No joke. They have a card with amber encased bugs in them. That's why. Floyd fan. Dropping the knowledge. Thanks for letting us know. You definitely don't want to eat baseball cards. Kids. And adults. I mean, who am I kidding? We might as well put that PSA out to everybody. I'd slather them in brown mustard. They'd be so delicious. Blue. No. 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 I can't wait till that yellow. It's going to feel so great when we get the yellow Ellie. Yelly. Can't wait. Just keep thinking about it and talking about it. Yelly. Lucky Peter. How are we? <clears throat> going to do any megas? Yeah, but my megas haven't shipped yet. I've been checking it every day, but I have a whole case of blasters I'm going to do as well. And then after I do all this retail, 
I'll probably buy whatever format for breaks. I overpaid for this stuff. Like, I think I got it. I think they were 15 bucks a box, and everybody was telling me that they're like $12 at, at Walmart. Man, I got ripped off. Not a lot happening. But just so you know, that's what the piles are like. You keep them there. For a bit. Uh, the O's did, they did, they got Corbin Burns. So you may have slept on that that move, but that's a big, big deal, AZ. Big, big deal. That's called, like, he's going to take them to maybe to the promised land. Quinn Priester got a couple, a couple of his cards already. Another perp though, so we're two perps to three blues at this point. Independence Day, Ellie. Yeah. That sounds great, Wiki. Might need more than that. They have more than that. But I mean, come on. Like, what do you expect? Like, they already got one of the best pitchers in the league. What do you want? Two? What are you, the Mets? What do you think? The Orioles are the Mets? Just buying up all the pitchers, the best pitchers? It didn't work out for them. And the O's... They don't want to just be making rash moves. They have such a glorious foundation that they're building with cheap, cheap superstar talent, young prospects slash rookies that they don't want to go too crazy. Danny Jansen gold. We've got another gold here. Vlad and... Samad Taylor. Oatman. And their offense is so prolific. So here's their, it's Corbin Burns, Kyle Bradish, which, what's the update on Bradish? UCL sprain. He's going to pitch in 2024, Kyle Bradish, allegedly. But Grayson Rodriguez, Corbin Burns, Kyle Bradish is, was going to be a nice one, two, three. We'll see what happens with Bradish. Kramer. Johnny Means still Johnny Means still alive, still kicking. What if he has a little bounce back season? There was a time when Johnny Means was really mean. Yeah, Trevor Bauer still still on the table. Snellington, don't forget about Snell. Austin. There's still time. I mean, Orioles could grab Snell. That'd be that'd be a monster move. That would be like we're looking to win it all this year kind of move. Not only this year, but years to come. Senzel. This isn't This 
Isn't going the best. I'm gonna stay positive about it though. Well, yeah, I mean, so Frito, you're not like this isn't for autos and relics. You don't open hangers for autos and relics. I wouldn't expect like out of the whole case, we'll probably get like maybe two, three of those things. We're doing this for yellows, basically. Parallels come out of here at a pretty nice clip. One of the best bang for your buck dollar per cards. We're just looking for a parallel. We're looking for a yellow Ella. Another yellow foil. <gasps> Golden Mirror. Golden Mirror Logan Allen. Be looking at Matt Walner deep in the fantasy drafts. Logan Allen. Too much tug. Do I need to get Clayton involved? Peyton says, yo, striker, this is my first time catching the stream live. 17, trying to flip sports cards. Been having trouble moving cards on eBay. What would you suggest? I would suggest lowering your prices. I don't know. That's one, that's one way to do it. If you're having trouble moving cards, you can always put them up for auction. They'll move. You will be disappointed in the price, but they will move. Cortez. Soto yellow. Byron Bucks an AL MVP this year. I don't think he's had like 500 plate appearances or 500 ABs ever. I don't know. I don't think he's had one healthy season in his entire career, Byron Buxton, but maybe this year's the year. I hear he's coming into camp in great shape. Anyone ever heard that one before? Byron Buxton, career 21 war. Career 106 OPS plus, so he is slightly better than average. You would think, but but Buxton's awesome. And I would say, I thought so too, until I looked at his 239 career average. 239 career average has never sniffed 500 ABs. Never even sniffed it. Let's look at his at-bats the last few years. 304. 340, 235, 130, 2020, 271, 90, 462, and 2017 was the closest he's ever come. But then before that, 298. We all know Buxton's injury history. He did have one good year, though. He's had one good year, and it was 2022 where he hit 28 home runs, a whopping 51 RBIs. How do you hit 28 home runs with only 51 RBIs? I'll tell you how. He batted 224. Pretty wild. Although 2021, he had a 171 OPS plus, just limited to 235 ABs. Byron Buxton. What's this backwards? 
Grand Gamers. Strange looking parallel. Blue? Blue parallel? Matheson. We'll put him on the stage. Maybe. I like this. I don't know. I feel like Brian Wu's my guy, even though he's a pitcher. But every once in a while, you know, I, I, I snag a couple pitchers as my guy, Strider. What do we do? Do we put, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think we put him on the stage, though. Decisions. Got to be really particular with who you put on the stage. Who and what and how and why. It's almost time to take these yellows off and start a new pile of yellows. Wu is not the next Kikuchi, Brian. How dare you? Never say that again. First of all, he's a righty. Who will be the rookie to make our cardboard great again? Ali De La Cruz. Don't you guys worry about Ellie. Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. Orange Julio. I love that. You know what? That that can go nicely with my Orange Julio rookie. PSA 10, by the way. My Orange Julio PSA 10. Gem Mint. I feel like I got Priester and Bregman yellows already. If I'm getting yellows in a double already and no goodens, I don't like that. Almost 800 in the chat. Thank you for being here. Don't forget to hit subscribe. I do have Patreon. Let me drop you a link to the Patreon. I got I got the links pulled up right here, ready to go. But I don't do like subscription boxes or anything like that at this point. But if anybody likes the channel and wants to support what I do, if you want to see more and you like the value videos and all the breakdowns and all that kind of stuff, consider joining the Patreon group. That's how I can keep doing this. And the slammers get notified when I post a break and they have a chance to buy in. We got some stuff going on here. Auto, be an auto. Not an auto. Blue Ryan Sandberg. Color match. Dansby, rainbow. Couple of yellows. That's about it. But the blue Ryan Sandberg. I'm going to go like that, and I don't know, just put them somewhere. B.A. Baracus says, limping preflop is pimping. <clears throat> You're welcome to come to my, my game anytime, my friend. If anybody likes limping preflop, it's always a place for you at the table. I feast on that. Mauricio Chrome. It's got a little value, I would think. 
So therefore, I'm going to sleeve them up. Back-to-back -back coal yellows. Time for a monster. I play in real life. I don't have a... I don't like playing online, really. There's too much cheating that goes on. Play IRL. That way I can use my deception detection. Here we go. Another relic. Well, we got two relics out of the deal so far. Going to need a little more than that. Chris, you leave Streambot alone. He's an ally. Century Baseball with a 499. First time back in a while. Just wondering if Skeens and Cruz have had firsts. Yes. 2023 Bowman Draft was Skeens. Cruz was, I don't remember when. You're applying for David Adams soon. What do you mean, to work there? Well, good luck and thanks for the dono. <laughs> Kid Poker went to the limping and pimping and his game went down limping and that while a hilarious and clever name, not a good strategy. A horrible losing strategy that will haunt you for your entire life. Why, oh why, did I limp with nines? Buxton and a red Astros team card. Maybe the music will make me feel better after that lovely hit. I don't even, I'm not going to top load it. I'm at that point. I'm not going to top load it right now. your favorite video game man see I, I don't do well with favorites but I do like like a dozen different video games currently I'm playing Diablo 4 but I like I, I, I like probably Call of Duty if, if I had to have a favorite although I haven't played this year's Call of Duty yet I uh, probably won't. Well, I mean, I, I, okay, I played over at my friend's house the first time the other day, but just one quick little match. It wasn't even a match. It was a resurgence. The names are not good. Like, this kind of stuff. A sign.
Oh, it didn't like that. It didn't like it when I fast forwarded through that song and then it crashed. Back to the video game talk. Civilization. I love Civ. Age of Empires. That's a fun one. Halo. I just don't want you to hit that fast forward button. Let's try. Monty, thanks for the sub. Would not have pegged me as a Civ player. Oh yeah, I'm a Civ player. I was really good at the last Civ. I got to the point where I could beat it on the hardest difficulty. That looks good. That looks really good. Number to 50, Strider to 50. I like these. I'm gonna cover up Logan Allen. Gold mirror Logan Allen, take a back seat. We're kind of getting down there a little bit. We got 24 left. We're kind of getting down there and this is, it's been very meh. Change your hat to the Reds hat for the Ellie Mojo. I don't know where my Reds hat is. Can change it to Texas. At least we could get an uh, Evan Carter. I'll take that. Eric with a 15 month. Appreciate the sentiment. Played, I played the original, the, or I would say like the first three Resident Evils back in the day. I'm kind of a gamer. Played a lot of games. Early adopter of the Nintendo Entertainment System. Played some Super Smash Brothers with my daughter last night. Got a W. Maybe a Billy sighting. Yeah, maybe we retire Striker Blade. For just a moment. Dude, this is so freaking loud. What happened? Why so loud? Thank you. Thank you. Distracting. RBI and A. I remember everything. Yeah. 
you were a Sega guy? Yeah, I was, my cousin was a Sega guy, so I got to play all the Sega games when I went to his house. But I was a Nintendo, Super Nintendo, all of it. Our first relevant rookie parallel in a while, Curtis Mead, blue, blue on blue. I'm going to top load him. And put him right there. The Vol Rainbow, Nailer, Yoshida. That looks good with the City Connect in the yellow. Yes. Yes. Fitzy has the world record on RBI baseball for the most runs scored in a game. No kidding. Wow. It's impressive. How's the mountain looking from your angle? Jeff, good morning. We're going to freeze, eh? Come on. Come back to us. This is the problem earlier. There we go. Usually I get one of these freezes and then it's good. It takes a minute to catch back up. While we're doing that, I'm gonna sweep this off just a bit. Get a lot of particles. Go Pistons. <laughs> Do you play Fortnite? I have, yeah. I don't really like it that much. My daughter is like really, really good at it. And I'm not just saying that. I'm saying that from a standpoint of someone who is a first person shooter. Like I'm good at Call of Duty. I'm good at FPS games. I'm good at most video games, if not all. And I'm saying she's really good, better than me. She just turned 10. But she was better than me when she was like seven. And she started her own YouTube channel. All She's been begging to, to start her own YouTube channel. And I'm like, oh, finally, after all the beggings, because I know what that means. When you start a YouTube channel, it means like, okay, time to work. It might not seem like it, but it is a lot of work. And I don't want her to have to start working like this early. I'm like, enjoy your life. If you want a YouTube channel, do that later. But she started one, just like with the, the game, just with her doing something silly on a game. And she's already got more subscribers than me. Just kidding, but it's gonna happen. And I'm going to get jealous when she has more subs than me and she's been doing it for like a quarter of the time. You good at pinball? I'm good at foosball. Got an HFA, and it's awesome. Man, they knocked these out of the park this year, didn't they? Home field advantage cards this year are spectacular. They're great. So is that what we can expect out of a case? An HFA, a golden mirror. Something else. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, guys. Technical issues. We're going to ride through it. Like it's not even happening. Oh, the mic's not working either. I'm telling you, when the when the system says, do you want to update? Just say nah. 
Save yourself a bunch of problems. Nah, I'm good. We don't need to update. No spins for sure, yeah. Good at losing in DFS. This year is going to be a big year for me <laughs> in daily fantasy. Last year was a bad year. It's a bad year all around. I just couldn't get it going. I don't know. I don't know why. Maybe it was the new rules. I didn't. I wasn't fluid enough. We got an autograph and it's a pitcher. Brandon Woodruff. One auto and two relics so far out of the case. Nice auto, Mr. Woodruff. It's a nice sig you got there. Cruz has not had a first in Bowman yet, says Train of Thought. Yeah, he'll he'll be in Bowman. This year's Bowman release. That should come out on May 8th. Allegedly. Big pile of cards. I hit fast for if I try to skip this song, it's gonna crash. You bet the Brewers trade him, Garrett? Yeah, I, I would think. How's that mountain looking? Decent. I think this pile is too too big of a pile. We're going to start a new yellow pile. Seed it. Seed it first. I have not Lex. I've not seen those yet. Unless they're just like randomly in the middle of the pack and I missed it. Kenley Jansen, yellow foil. Brady Singer, blue. I'm, I'm getting a little frustrated. We haven't gotten one of the big three in a parallel. Frustration mounting. 18 more boxes to go, though. We got 18 more shots. Do you build sets every year with the base cards? Yeah. I won't with the with these, though. But with a lot of stuff I do. Bowman is for sure. Update, yes. Chrome, tops chrome, yes. And then if I open up a lot of something else I do. No trench coat guy for series one, asked Justin. Well, you must have missed it. Trench coat guy delivered. Finally, another stars of MLB. Chrome, which. We're getting some numbered stuff. You know what would be hilarious? If it, if it froze up. Even though I didn't skip it. Varsho. What's our outlook on Varsho this year? I'm going to just kind of put him over there. James says Civilization is one of my favorite games of all time. Yeah, me too. I like how you can just step away from it. 
if you need to, even though you don't want to because it's a fun game, but and it's a long game, can be. But how you can just like step away, go get something to eat, come back, turn based, so it doesn't matter. Trey Cabbage. We're getting the foils though. It's to four ninety nine. We're gonna need a miracle. A couple of miracles in the last couple dozen packs. Yeah, just one more turn. Too many late nights. It's a great game for Michigan because the weather's so poor all the time. It's like, well, at least I got a sieve. Okay. Clayton, I need you, buddy. He's going to be right off the screen. See, right here. Soaking. We'll save those four for the end. See how Clayton does. How many dingers will show hit, hey hit this year? You're going 50 to 55. Whoa. It's a lot. I would say 42. Danny asking if the Fanatics boxes have been released yet. I don't think so. I haven't gotten any shipment notifications. We're getting down there. March 7th for those Fanatics boxes, eh? Foundation's a little shaky. I don't know how high we can go with the Jenga, Jenga board. So we're gonna have a little bit of time. We're gonna. I'm gonna come back and stream again, probably five o'clock, and we'll do some high roller series one breaks. I incorporated some high end stuff with some series one, so that way we've got. A shot at greatness.
Not a lot to talk about. Waiting to see that low numbered case hit. Oops. Don't tell me what to do, Garrett. Another relic. I'm not going to be happy unless we hit one of the big three in a parallel. I don't even, I'm not even asking for an auto. I'm not even asking for a numbered parallel. Very floor base level expectations. I don't even want a major league material of those guys. I just want a parallel. <clears throat> Good time to buy Royce Lewis. I don't know. <clears throat> okay. Couple of good rookies. In a parallel. Okay. This is this is how it begins. Evan Carter Rainbow Foil. This is how it begins. And we build from here. We got Clayton soaking to the left. It's only gonna get better. We got the easiest parallel to pull, essentially. But it's a good start. And <clears throat> we're gonna put him in front of Curtis Mead. Okay, building, success, Matos, it's a little secondary hit. I'm top loading it, that tells you something. And we'll, what are we gonna do with you? Kinda running out of room here. All right, vibes, lifting, parallel trout. It's getting better and better by the second. feeling it now hot hands <clears throat> feeling it Running out of coffee. Basically, basically out. It's at the bottom. I don't like the bottom, the bottom of the coffee. It's kind of like the bottom of a beer. Pretty gross. Ooh, that would look good. Evan Carter would look real good with the blue. Come on.
bust pack. No. Yes. Jordan Lawler rookie, Chrome. It's pretty good. I'm going to sleeve him. Just because. But that's it. Yikes. Got to hit a nuke. the big three. Ellie De La Cruz, Jason Dominguez, Evan Carter. And there's like a dozen other rookies that are good. And you know, it's okay. They're, they're okay hits. This is a decent one. I like Encarnacion Strand. This is one of those guys. One of the other dozen. If he, if he gets PT, he's got like 30 plus home run upside. Stacking him up. We have three more regular boxes to go. Then we'll get to the Clayton Soak boxes. Mr. In Fuego with a $2 donation, 900 plus watching and only 340 likes. Let's fix this. We're almost to a thousand. Everybody who's here stays around for like less than five minutes. We'll be at a thousand, like two minutes. I need it. I need the good vibes. We got to pull something good here. Best card so far. Nothing to speak of really. Evan Carter Rainbow Foil. Best card so far. Not going to get it done. Uh, you could say the HFA Julio. Best card. Uh, that's probably better. We got an auto. Brandon Woodruff auto. I guess that's okay. Riley Relic. Bunch of stuff. Oh, we're in the danger zone. Shelves look bare. Yeah, Javier, I don't know about you, but my Walmart stocks on Saturdays. So they may not have been out yet. Uh-oh. Bust pack. Chrome. Getting real sloppy. Chrome Trout. There's Ellie. That's something. We've got five left. This is the last one that hasn't been soaked by Clayton. Looking for a big finale. A grand one. Oh, we're close to a Jenga. Another bust pack. If you get a Chrome Stars of MLB, that's essentially a bust pack. Maybe not. Maybe we get a rainbow and a blue. Man, the names are just not there with these parallels. It's not going. It... Mm. 
All right, Clayton, did you do it or didn't you? Of course you did. Try to save it, even though I know that's an illegal move. Home run challenge. Arenado. Not enough plastic on top to grab that one. <clears throat> Gold. We may have redemption here. I see a red border. Could it be? It would have saved the case. And a yellow foil. That would have saved the case right there. That was so close. Oh, it's still decent, but not. Oh, wow. What a pack. Wow. Two numbered hits. It's Alec Thomas, though. I mean, that's not that's not that bad. Not that bad. More more like that, though. I need a few few more chances. If both of these would have been Ellie, we're talking different kind of mood. There's a lot of secondary stuff happening, but. Oh, man. Jeez, that was close. Oh, oh, oh. Still a shot. Clayton? Still a chance. Two, two more. Oh, we're almost at a thousand. Nine ninety three. Let's go. Possibly a Reds logo. No. Oh, we actually got a de couple decent cards here. Look at this. Henry Davis. <laughs> um, Henry Davis Mother's Day. That is a, that's actually a pretty nice card. That's that's a nice card. Number one overall pick, Henry Davis. It's not bad. Clayton? All right. The pinks are not pink, though, are they? They're, um, they are a 
powdery rose. I don't know what to call that, but it is not hot pink. Henry Davis to 50. What do we do? Put him in front of, yeah. And this American League leaders with Shohei on there. Yellow for, yeah, home run leaders. That's not too bad. Are we going to finish in a good way? Really good way? We might. One last pack. Everything on the line. Over a thousand, we hit our goal. That tip. It's, it's all about the Texas hat, eh? We'll give the Texas City Connect hat all the credit. Come on! We're building a lot of momentum here towards the very end. Last pack magic. not it but let's look at what we did get because we did get some things we did get some things and let's check it out i i gotta you're gonna freeze got it got it we don't need it all right, where do we begin? How about how about the cards I got too lazy with to, to do anything about? Alec Thomas purple. Actually, we'll go to the back. Bunch of numbered cards. I think when we look at it all together, It'll, it'll feel a little better. So let's start with let's go like this. A bunch of rainbow foils. A bunch of them. Brian Wu was a, a decent one. Nothing there though. Blues. Eh. Eh. It's, it's okay. It's, it's okay. It's collectible. I like. like it a little bit. We got this blue Ryan Sandberg. It's okay. Chrome stars of MLB. Handful of them. We're well on our way to a complete set. How many golds do you get? I know that's the question everybody's wondering. How many numbered golds? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, plus what, what we have on the stage. So we actually got probably, we did a little better than the odds on golds. Yellows, hundreds of them. Hundreds and hundreds of them. We got this yellow trout. These are all secondary hits. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of them. But secondary trout. Yellow foils. Not too bad, that one. It's okay, but all the other ones, not the best. How many did we get though? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He's like one in 10. Seven plus. That's about right. Kind of beat the odds on that. Some foil. Foil board, numbered stuff, greens. A couple of these. These are numbered to 499. 
couple of these and a red, the 199 plus the stage stuff. Blues, we actually got quite a few blues. These are to 999. Boom, 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 boom. Soderstrom, maybe the best one. Rookie, it's okay. Perps, lower numbered, gonna get less of them to 799. Alec Thomas, Priester, eh. little Aaron Nola, game used relic, just chilling. Plenty of home run challenge cards. Thought we'd actually get more than that, but it's about right, I guess. Chrome Ellie De La Cruz. Maybe the hit of the break or close to it. Home field advantage Julio. Looks crisp. I must send that off, actually. It looks really clean. Yeah. Vintage stock, we did get one. And these are numbered to 99. Amazing vintage stocks this year. A plus. A couple more relics. Riley, game used. Salvador Perez, game used. Game used bat. Yellow Ice. Spencer Strider to 50. That's a good card. I like that. And we did get a golden mirror. Logan Allen. So... The case has case hits. Like we're kind of getting, or like quote unquote case hits. Like we're talking golden mirror. These are to 50. That's, kind of, that's a tough hit. HFA. You know, we got, we got the low numbered vintage stock. So these are all like tough hits right here. As well as the team logo border. Another tough hit. These look awesome. Starling Marte. That was from earlier. The earlier rip. What do we go to next? Henry Davis. I mean, that might be the hot B. I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Is this the hot B? We got to kind of come to an agreement. But Mother's Day, Henry Davis, rookie to 50. It's a big card. Brandon Woodruff auto. This Julio's pretty crazy. Not crazy, but cool. I like it. I just like it because it's orange and it matches my other orange. And those are numbered to 299. That's a cool hit. Um, the biggest hit of the break. A couple of nice secondary rookies. Sal Freelich. I like that. Julio Rainbow. Nick Gonzalez. Colton Kowser. Those are our best yellows, I think. Oh, we got a couple here, too. Another really nice hit. Incarnacion Strand, gold, numbered to 2024, and we're matching them up with the yellow. So my new guy, CES, Evan Carter, Rainbow Foil, Curtis Mead Blue, Grand Gamers. We didn't get a lot of the parallels in uh, the insert parallels, but we did get this. And Luis Matos Blue. What do we think? All in all, let's grade it. Put it in the chat. Grade it. Ceiling on a case like that. We're not talking about autos. You don't expect a good, huge auto out of here. You expect a couple of parallels of the rookies you want. And we didn't get it. We didn't get the big three other than the rainbow foil. But I mean, we kind of hit some stuff. A golden mirror. To 50, HFA, that Julio, we got an auto, Henry D I mean, we did kind of hit some stuff. Just not the top top. I don't know. I'm thinking like, I'm thinking like B minus. Ooh, already a lot of B minus is coming in. 7.2 out of 10, C plus, B minus range. I think that's where we're at, C plus, B minus range. Father and son thinks B. Allen, D minus. Oh, I think it's better than a D minus. You're being harsh. D plus, C minus, C minus, B, C, B minus. 5 of 10, ERB. 
C plus, B, B, B minus, C, B minus, 7.5 out of 10. I'm going to go with, uh, you know, B plus, or, uh, B minus, C plus range. So maybe a, it's probably like a 7.9 out of 10, maybe 7.8 7 out of 10. But then again, think you could think of it like, let's say we didn't get just even one of these. Like if we didn't get that card, I'd, I'd drop it down. If we didn't get that, I'd drop it down. Big. So we got cards that are worthy of like improving your grade. That especially, that's a big one to get at, towards the end there. I don't know what that's worth, but that I'm going to try to maybe gem that up. I don't know. That's sweet. So like if we didn't get that, you know, we're talking C. Just one card can kind of bump it up. I don't know. Either way, it was fun hanging out with you guys. We're going to be right back at it in like four more hours. So get ready for some Friday Night Fire. Thanks for watching.